So get ready for a fascinating day in the life of a fascinating and enigmatic, in other words, person. <laughs> Today's episode. How are you doing? Webbers and Webber, welcome. I'm just warning you. Oh, I'm wearing my new Kinomomo from IKEA. Uh, I'm just warning you that today is going to be all about spring cleaning. So get ready for a fascinating day in the life of a fascinating and enigmatic, in other words, person. People, I give you my fascinating breakfast. These are my peanut butter and jam and banana sandwiches topped with sesame seeds and pumpkin seeds. I just love them. Earl Grey. So my living room is sort of in order if you don't look too closely. But let me show you the reason why that looks good. It's because my hallway looks like this. It doesn't usually look like this. <laughs> it usually looks so much better. But... Today, I'm going to fix all of this. Welcome to the, what I call the show, You Are Kim is going to fix it. I'm going to fix it. I'm going to fix it. I'm going to fix it now. So I've sort of have these furry rugs on the floor in my hallway and I kind of like the feeling, but I want something bigger. I want sort of like wall to wall carpeting in this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these old, I have this one, this old one here in this living room. No, sorry. Well, I almost live here. It's my bedroom. I'm going to put this one and another one that I've got in the living room. I'm going to try cutting them up and putting them there and they do look kind of grey, but they are white. I don't know why they come off as off white. So to start with, I'm just going to put these two out on the balcony. So I'm going to start by removing this rug, but then I sort of, as I will be moving everything from it, I'm, I'm just going to get another rug from the cellar, from the basement, sorry, to, I hope it will work nicely with this one. So you see this to this. It's okay, isn't it? I mean, it corresponds with the sofa. Might be a little too energetic, I don't know. Maybe this is not for spring and summer, maybe this is for winter, but I'll keep it like this for, well, till I can get a new rug. So now, peoples, I've got some cutting to do, because that mat, <laughs> That rug is just, well, I don't know how many centimetres is that? 15, 20, 25? Don't know, don't care. So this works really well. I started out by using one of those sort of carpet cutters, uh, paper cutters, I don't know, this was not working out. And then I got my trusty bread knife and it just slices through like... Well, it slices through. Okay, people, does that not look fantabulous? Now I'm just going to take the other mat, the rug, sorry, from my bedroom and sort of cut that up and put it there. Then I will be one happy gay guy. So this gay guy is kind of happy. I'm just going to take one of the leftover pieces and sort of try to make it fit there because then I will be happy. And, you know, this is sort of a shadow. It doesn't, it isn't that bad. Looks like a sort of stain. Damn it. Peoples, I mean, peoples, I am dead pleased. I got floor to floor carpeting made from old sort of rugs. This is a happy man. Je suis contente, as they say in Denmark. <laughs> 